And if it was a shoot, I legitimately believe that you and Barbaria could be any of today's tag teams. Oh, yeah. I mean, I have no question about that whatsoever. And give us Haku, too. <laughs> yeah. Well, yeah, that would just be frightening. You could beat an entire company with that team. <laughs> Speaking of which, Barbarian told us the story that you had witnessed the night that Haku bit somebody's uh, nose off in the bar. Could you tell us that story? Yeah. Um, yeah, it was actually in Baltimore. It was at the Sephora Club. We were staying at the Holiday Inn. Got done doing a show. Got back to Holiday Inn. We said, well, we're going to go out. So we go to the Sephora Club. That's where everybody went. It was always a club just across the highway, just jam-packed all the time. So that's where all the wrestlers go. So we go there. And I was walking around, and Tonga Kid was there, you know, and a few other guys. And as I walk around, I see Haku there. He's drinking a beer, just kind of looking. So I go up to him. I said, Haku, what are you doing? He said, oh, good, brother. I'm doing good. You know, so I'm just enjoying my beer. So we go on. All of a sudden, I come inside. I'm just walking around. So I kind of look at him. And you can see he's kind of got this focus on something. I'm like, oh, no. Oh, no. I hope not. Also, he just starts going through the crowd. I mean, just starts walking like he's in a, in a measure staring, you know. Goes down, grabs this guy. I'm looking at him. Just all of a sudden, the next thing I know, there's just blood everywhere. Just blood all over the place, you know. And, oh, you got to be kidding me. You know, so Tonga Kid and me, we ran over there right away. We all were able to get him back to the hotel at the Holiday Inn. So I said, you know what? I'm going to get Haku up to the room, you know. Let's get him up to the room. I don't, I don't want him in the bar here, you know. We got able to get him up in the room. He was like, okay, I'm, I'm good, guys. I'm, I'm just going to stay here. I'm, I'm good. So we go back down. After we go back down, about a minute later, here he comes down to the bar down there. Now he's in the bar down there. Great. I, I don't want to say anything. You know, near and song a kid. <clears throat> Next thing you know, you got all these cop cars coming to the front of, of the Holiday Inn, you know. And as they come to the door, we look at this guy. Whoa, 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 hold a second. You know, you look at Baku. Give it a couple minutes because he'll, he'll be relaxed. Right now he'll fight. And he'll go. Okay, cool, we'll go. If you give him a couple minutes, he'll be he, he'll be no problem, you know. And so it's kind of like you remember the Blues Brothers are all when they're in the uh, <laughs> yes, all, I see. That, all these cops are around. That's what it was like. All these cops are in the in the lobby. After a couple minutes, you know, they went and they went up to him and he turned around and they go, "What's well, your?" He put his hands out. He goes, "No problem." I mean, it was simple. You know, you just need to diffuse the situation a little bit. You know, that's all it was. You know, I mean, Haku was, huh, was, him and Barb, I think, were two of the toughest individuals I've ever known. Thank you for watching the Hannibal TV. Please like this video if you enjoyed it and click the subscribe button to not miss any of our latest shoot interviews, match videos, or news updates. Support us on Patreon.com for $1.99 a month to watch our full shoot interviews ad-free and help our channel grow. Follow us on Twitter at The Hannibal TV for instant updates.